Hey guys, it's Hamster Fanatic26, and today's video is going to be Hamster Don'ts. This video was requested by Turts and Torts, and I will put her link in the description bar below. So let's get started. So keep in mind, this is my third up time trying this video and deleting it. So hopefully this time I'll like it. So let's get started. The first hamster don't is don't breed your hamster. Reason being is because it can be fatal to not only the mother but the babies as well. It can they, the babies can become deformed or irregular at birth, which can cause cannibalism to the mother um, from the mother to the babies. The next hamster don't is don't use scented beddings. The reason being is that it can in interfere with a hamster's sense of smell. It can be ve very stressful for a hamster at times when it is trying to okay. when it is trying to forage for water, food, etc. The next hamster don't is don't use cotton wool bedding materials. The reason being is because it can get wrapped around a hamster's limbs and even cut off circulation in that limb. The next hamster don't is do not put Syrian hamsters together as cage mates. They're strictly solitary and they only come together before sexual maturity or in the breeding session. So you never want to put them together because they will fight to the death. Next hamster don't is don't use pine cedar or sawdust beddings and I cannot stretch this hamster don't enough. The reason being is because these have um, sent oils in it that extracts necessary hamster oils that are in their fur that can cause dehydration and it can cause respiratory problems for the hamster. The next hamster don't is don't keep your hamster in a small size cage. Now don't call me a hypocrite for rodeo's cage. I already understand so no criticism needed or wanted. So the reason is that hamsters are very active animals and they are very active around 5.30 p.m. or a.m. and 6.30 6 a.m. So they also need a lot of running space. In the wild, they can travel from up to 3 to 5 miles per night, so don't restrict them. The minimum of space requirements are 360 square inches at the bare minimum and, the, and that does not include ramps or levels. The next hamster don't is don't bathe the hamster or let it swim. The reason being is because hamsters are fairly clean animals and they love to groom themselves. However, if your hamster is older, it might decrease as a fault to the old, the age of the hamster. And it's a and I never on, only let your hamster near water if they have become infected with a disease such as wet tail or they just got really. Yeah, wet tail is the only one that's probably going to make them need a bath or something to wipe off their bottom because they have got um, really wet poo and stuff like that. And the final hamster don't is don't provide your hamster with a mesh or wired wheel. The reason being is because it can cause bumblefoot and it is really hard on the hamster's paws or foot pads. Oh, and I have one more. Sorry about that. And the last hamster don't, the real last one, is don't provide your hamster with warm water during colder seasons. And the reason being is because um, it can be really gross faster than you think, and it, um, it attracts bacteria faster than cold water does. So you don't want your water to be infected with bacteria or anything, because it can get moss in it. So even if it is colder, just put it on, um, just put it just with the regular cold water because it's going to stay in their cage anyway until they come out to drink it so it's kind of going to get cold anyway so that's basically all my hands to don'ts guys hopefully i like this video or i will be deleting and trying it again sorry i just can't do a video and i don't like it i deleted it that's just instinct for me so thanks for watching hope i helped with some of your hamster don'ts and um Feel free to comment below if I missed one so I will put it in future videos. So thanks for watching guys. Bye.